Whatever they are speaking is getting uh, audio visualization words. Eh? It's kind of like a, in this kind of spectrum. One of the early projects I got in was uh, making this, uh, you know, like very cheap and affordable computer out of Raspberry Pi. So I wasn't a part of figuring out the audio and you know other small parts of it, uh, while the designers were building the whole casing and everything. So. This month I was building the audio system, sorry, how to make it work and how to make it feel like a laptop itself, even if it's just $35 cheap. That was the first thing that, okay, if this thing works, like I can Google things and I can make things happen just to feel awesome. <laughs> I didn't want to be a doctor or a nurse or go into health subjects or any of that. So I choose uh, physical, uh, physics, like physics group. There was optional like computer. So why waste time? We got into computer science and at that point I got so interested in the programming itself. I mean, it, the interest started to develop more and more. Like making things out of code was like something very interesting to me. One needs to buy it. Did you hear saying? Yeah. So I've been doing this for a while, and it's really something I'm passionate about. So I would like to go get into uh, IT subjects to buy it, and also the whole, you know, like the all the sci-fi movies that was inside of me also came out, and I decided I'm going to go into electronics engineering the, with the possibility that I might make a lightsaber someday. I can't even remember when I got into you know like all this craze about lightsaber and you know holograms and all these things. I don't even remember. I know it was like Star Wars was just <laughs> in the theaters in those days. And Titi say like yeah, making those uh, futuristic stuff would be really great to see. Also, I was into this DIY and crafts or many other so building things. with uh, girls, young girls who are in their college years or who are very interested in getting into technological field or are still in high school. We do workshops, we have like uh, workshops who, who, that we work in leadership part or technical part only, different, different things. So in the technical part, we go into more into programming, coding, hardware, software stuff. So leadership much and more go more into uh, public speaking, having that professional influence on a uh, community and all those things. So, uh, so to do my mixed career, say how can we get young girls to become leaders and innovators of tomorrow's Nepali technological field? One, yes, I am. So.